Well, and good morning, everyone. Um, it's Saturday, eight twenty-one a.m. Um, and I just got a, a message here uh, on my Facebook account. A lot of spam, you know, comes there. But um, this was not it, and. Um, uh, maybe I've got a net before, but it's no harm in rehearsing it because it's all about uh, detecting a stroke if someone has had a stroke. And I thought it was uh, important enough to to make a video because it kind of freaked me out a bit. It still does. Um, <coughs> I'll read it to you and translate here. Under a party. A girl tumbled. Uh, she was called Ingrid. She tumbled and fell. Uh, she ensured everyone that she was all right. They offered to call a doctor, uh, but that she had just uh, tripped in a stone because she had new shoes. They helped her, helped her to get organized, and gave her a new plate of food. And even though she seemed a bit shaken. Uh, Ingrid still enjoyed the rest of the evening. Her husband called later on and told that she has been uh, had been uh, driven to the hospital. And at um, 6 a.m. she was dead. Ingrid had um, gotten a stroke at a party. And um, if uh, someone had known how to recognize the sign of a stroke, she might be alive today. And uh, a neurologist says that um, if he gets a hands on a patient with a stroke, within three hours he can uh, totally reverse the effect, totally, of that stroke. He says that a hard and difficult thing is to recognize a stroke, to get it diagnosed, and to have the patient to a doctor in three hours. But there's three things that we all can do uh, uh, to help on this, because there's uh, three ways to uh, detect a stroke. And that's uh, three simple questions. One, ask the person to laugh. Two, Ask the person to lift both arms. And three, ask the person to say a simple sentence. For example, the sun is shining today. And if that person has troubles with any of these tasks, call the emergency number and describe the symptoms. If we all uh, if we all keep this in mind, uh, we can help their lives. It's all um, yeah. Thanks for watching, people, and uh, well.